Can we get Roman, boys? Because the action is hot and heavy, and I got to wrangle someone, uh, some VIP of some sort. Should I just go straight for Sheckler? That would be freaking nuts. Maybe I got to talk to the Red Bull guy first and get permission. He's, he'll see me and just freaking out of here. Okay, here we go. We're going straight into the mix here. Red Bull foam wreckers, look at it. It's, it's not even 12 yet, and this place is bonkers. I just slipped under the Red Bull zone. Here's Kike. We're going to come up on the wheel of fortune here. Look at this St. Clement. Ryan Sheckler's here. This is crazy. Yes. Look at this is how gnarly St. Clement is. You walk around, and Ryan Sheckler's here. SC, baby. Happy to be here, man. Sun's coming out. Waves are all right. It's fun. It's a good time. Thank you. Could we wrangle you on the couch at one point? Of course. We got your clips, so we're going to review your clips from today. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, you heard that, fans. Ryan Sheckler's going to come on the couch. Thank you. Dude, you see that? I got him already. Just straight to the biggest dog of them all. Kalani Rob. All the kids said you were their favorite. These kids are crazy. I'm old. Who, they don't even know. What, what's going on? They like bodyboarders? Dude, it was unanimous. Watch the replay. They were all freaking out. Doing it? That counts. Nice. Uh, well, uh, we, How'd you we go there? Yeah, I caught a couple ways. It wasn't my best, you know, uh, T Street it, um, ripping sesh, but we got it. Of course, Kalani Rob handles every time. <laughs> What, can we get you on the couch a little later? I'll get, uh, I'll get, give him the jersey back here and then we'll get back. We'll okay, get back. sick. What about you, Ryan? You want to join us on the couch? When? Right now, if you can. Yes! Woo, the big dogs are coming on. Let's go, let's go see what's up. Yes. This guy's going to embarrass me. Not even, no way. Are you kidding me? We would never do that. Yes, okay, holy crap, we got our checklers coming on. No hesitation, we're going straight for the biggest dog on the beach. He's been professionally trained, I'm sure, for this kind of stuff. Over there on three. three. All right. Holy crap. Two. One, number two. Number two. Number wow. two? Is this number two? Oh, sorry. That was the... My bad. Here. This one. You want me to sit next to you? No, dude. We need the branding. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> that makes sense. Okay. Oh, my God. I'm already nervous. We got Sheckler on straight away. He just surfed his heat. Um, how many of these events have you done? None. This None is, is your the, first uh, one? Yeah, this is the first time I've actually been in town when this is going on. So um, they hit me up, and I was stoked, and we showed up. And uh, actually putting on a jersey felt crazy. I know it's like a fun uh -huh. deal, but I still... Uh, as a competitor, <laughs> I the still The competitive I still juices felt started flowing? Yeah. Yeah, but it was cool. It was, it's rad to be in the same heat as Costin, you know, like my whole skate career, uh, especially in the beginning. I was always competing with Costin skating. So to compete in something fun like this, and, and I, say, I say compete loosely, to like go surf with Costin and only have five or six people out at T Street. Oh my um, God, how epic is that? It's pretty dope because I live here and I never get Ryan T Street. Ryan is the five man, people. skate or die. We got the audio. The fans are going nuts. They can't even believe you're on this thing. I'm happy to be here, man. Yeah, it's uh, it's cool that they do it in San Clemente at T Street. You know, I, I used to live literally right right up here on Cristobal. So really? um, it's cool. This is the beach I would walk to every day. And um, were you gro growing up in San Clemente, so it's sick. Were you getting in the water and surfing when you were younger? Was yeah, I, I think I started surfing at like 13, 14. Um, not for... Not for, like, lack of love for surfing. I just was so focused on skate yeah. that I spent all my time on the concrete. And then uh, realized what I had in front of me and in my backyard and then started utilizing it and then can't get out of the water I at love all. it. Yeah, I love it. Well, I mean, when you're that good at skating, you, you might want to stick to that one. <laughs> uh, you know, it's like it, it was what was making sense. But, like, surf for me has always been, like, a stress relief and – really a grounding experience because it's hard you know like i'm used to concrete i don't mind how the concrete feels i know it's always going to be the same and the ocean is always different you're never going to catch the same wave um it depends on how you fall whether or not you're going to hit the bottom or not and i'm, I'm not the, the best surfer i just really enjoy it that's awesome yeah little softer landings on the surf department though yeah sometimes <laughs> so you have a uh 
Oh, we got some replay. We're oh, filming we don't, your we heat. Don't need to see oh, my this waves, is the fun man. stuff. No, bro. There it is. You and Costin right there. Look at he goes down nose pearl. Then you give him the freaking <laughs> what? Why'd you try to burn me? No. <laughs> that wasn't even the burn. I was hoping. <laughs> I hope he made it. Another one at all? That was sick. I heard the uh, premise of this. Uh, this expression session is to have fun, so I was just trying to have fun with him out oh, yeah. there. It's all about fun, this stuff. We were, laugh think, we were I, laughing the whole time. It seems like inherently when you get on those soft tops, you just want to like have fun and goof around versus like a regular like short board. It definitely takes a little bit of the like uh, the fierceness out of out of it, and like it welcomes fun for sure, for sure. But yeah, it was cool. Uh, I definitely don't think we made it. <laughs> Made it you through. didn't get your results yet? No, which sucks because I do want to <laughs> surf. Like, I want to keep surfing for sure. Oh, they uh, should just let you then. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> we'll, we'll see what happens. But um, super fun. Everyone's having a good time, man. The food's good. All the sponsors that came out are incredible. Red Bull obviously putting this thing on. I got my family down here, my little daughter. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, so it's just a, it's a fun, family-friendly event for sure. And people are ripping. Oh, yeah. You know, there's tons of, like, local SC kids out here guys and girls just going for it so it's cool it's cool to see yeah right in your hometown yeah san clemente is crazy there's so many talented people like you got the best surfers in the world and the best skaters it's i don't know what's what's in the water here what do you think i'm not sure man i think it's just like it's an inviting you know city to live in like it the uh the opportunities to go surf and to go skate like they're they're everywhere you know so action miss jackson if you want to surf you can surf you want to skate Come to my park. <laughs> yeah. Or my nephew goes to your park. He loves it. Oh, rad. Skate with Shane. Oh, wipe out. Yeah. Were you wearing a leash out there? Ryan, what's your favorite state to go for a skate? Favorite state? state. Um, man, I really, really like Colorado. Colorado's uh, kind of a, a hidden gem. I won't talk much more about it, but it's... <laughs> Secret uh, spots. It, it's got spots for days and... You can go out there for seven days and come home with half a part done, for sure. Are, are you working on any big projects right now, or what's what's next for you? So I just dropped uh, I just dropped Lifer, which was the video part I've been working on uh, for Red Bull for the last uh, three years, and we dropped a documentary called Rolling Away. Both yeah. of those are on YouTube and on Red Bull. Uh, I was Red just Bull. watching com. the Rolling Away. So now I'm, uh, I'm going to start filming for Sandlot Times. I have a skateboard company that I started a little over a year ago, and we got a cool little team going, and we're going we're gonna to film a video. I'm not sure how long it's going to be or what it's going to look like, but we're just going to start stacking clips and uh, see what it turns into. What's your favorite part about, like, filming and making movies? Um, the chase. You know, I, I think it's the chase of not knowing what you're going to get or not knowing really how the project itself is going to form and what it's going to look like. And only time will tell. And, and really, like, how many trips you go on, who's on the trips. Like, it's all about energy uh, for me. So if I'm traveling with a group of, of guys I really enjoy skateboarding with, that gets transferred into the film, and you can actually see that you're having fun. When I get into a headspace where I'm like, ah, man, i got to get this done, i got to get this done, it gets a little stiff. So um, I try to keep filming very, like, fluid and very fun and kind of laid back. And obviously you like so it's nothing like pre-planned like you said like the waves you don't know what you're gonna get but before you start a movie do you have like a checklist of what you want to get i'll have i'll have at least like five to ten spots that i want to skate i don't know the tricks yet i just know that something about this spot is appealing to me and that's where i want to skate and so i'll plan trips around these locations and then go there and then see on that day really what my brain is like telling me to do or go try or what I'm comfortable with. Right. Yeah. Sick. I love it. Yeah, man. What we got more don't we have a couple more waves or no? No, I got like I got no waves that are. No, worth, you had one worth, airdrop, worth, I remember. Watching. He I doesn't felt like want I was to on a boogie board. No man. one wants to see themselves surf for some reason. Shacks through the the fans are going cuckoo. It's all about the inner kid having fun. I agree with that. I He's agree just with an that. inner kid. Yeah, no, we don't need to show any of my <laughs> Okay, <man. laughs> you can't find it. It, it was bad. It, it was, was fun, though. It's all about fun. I had fun. I definitely Silly went straight. Fun. I went straight on a lot of waves. 
Any surf trips planned? You ever gone on a surf trip? Yeah, I, I go to Nicaragua. Um, every year I go to, uh, go to Nica for, I don't know, 10 days to two weeks and surf out there at Colorado's and oh, yes. yeah. uh, kind of take a boat around playgrounds and just go have fun with my friends that surf and uh, kind of kind of check out for a little bit. And that's always super fun. Um, I'd love to go on some more surf trips, man. Where's like Where's a destination you'd like to go surf? Um, I'd like to get out to like, I don't know, man. I'd like to get out to Tahiti, like Kemper's, uh, Billy Kemper. They always tell me that they go out there and they have like the most incredible trip and it's super fun for all sorts of, um, all levels. skill level and, um, something I can bring my, my wife and my daughter to and just kind of want to make it family friendly, but I also want to like get a little bit scared of waves. I'm not, uh. <laughs> Like I said, I'm not the best surfer. I just want to have fun, go fast. You probably like a little adrenaline rush, though. Yeah, it's just in your nature, probably. <laughs> yeah, I work. I work well with adrenaline for sure. But um, surfing's a different animal. It's a completely different animal for me, and um, I have a lot of respect for the ocean and for the power <clears throat> of waves. Like even, you know, I might sound lame, but like some days, T Street, it's like too big for me. You know, yeah, it's yeah. like I mean, I get. Um, I don't know. I'm just super like hyper hyper focused on sometimes what can go wrong surfing because I'm not that comfortable. Um, like I said, skating and concrete is it's no problem. I know what I know what that variable is. I know what it feels like. Um, sometimes sometimes big waves scare me <laughs> for sure. What's been like your hairiest situation like in Hawaii or something? Or? No, in Nicaragua um, for sure. Yeah, yeah. just to, and it and it's still like it's pretty much shore break. You know, it's a it's a beach break, yeah. but. Um, it got really big and it, it thrashed me and slammed me into the ground and, yeah. um, what's well, big, big barrels there. There are big barrels there and I didn't get any of them. <laughs> <laughs> I tried. I tried. You're out there though. That's sick. I'm trying, you know. Oh, coffin the nose pearl. Woo. That's Kalani's friend. Um, I forget his name, but yeah, we're fun. Having fun on the Red Bull foam wreckers. Well, I don't want to take up too much of your time. All good, so. brother. No, thanks for having me on. Thanks yeah, for the thank invite. Yeah, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Really uh, appreciate it. Being here. Rad to see Shaq. It's costing out there, yes. Yeah, it's fun. We need a Coast 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 surf and skate off. That would be dope. That would be dope. That would be super dope. Get this a team is like together. the Slamarack on, of couch shows. I don't know what that means. But <laughs> Neither do I. Rat. Rat Town Rules, AB Florida. These guys are going crazy on the comments. Thanks, boys. Keep the stoke going. Awesome. Thank you so much. No Appreciate worries, it. There he no is, worries, Ryan Shagler. Thank you, guys. We went Eww. straight to the biggest dog on the beach, and we got him. There he goes. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. All right. Woo, where do we go from there? It's all downhill now.